What is going on guys? My name is Bryce Till. Welcome to my outdoor channel. Earlier this week I got my first injection mold and I'm really excited because now I get to make my own soft plastics. So I just wanted to make a video to show you guys how I make soft plastic baits and uh, we're gonna see how it goes. So let's make some baits. All right so we're gonna start with about a third of a cup of our Plastisol, we're going to put that in the microwave for about 90 seconds to get started. Alright, so we're going to be shooting a crappie fluke mold. Um, I'm going to be going crappie fishing with my brother-in-law in, on Sunday. So I asked him what colors he wanted and he said just a blackened chartreuse crappie fluke. So we're going to go ahead and shoot the tails first and they're going to be chartreuse. So our plastic's heated up, we're going to go ahead and add our colorant. This is just a Do It Molds chartreuse colorant. About 10 drops. Let's see what we got there. I want to make that just a little bit darker. That right there should be perfect. All right, plastic's at about 280 degrees. We need to heat it up to about 350, so probably Put that in there for about 15 seconds, get it warmed back up, and then we'll go ahead and shoot these. Let's see where we're at now. About 365, that'll shoot. Draw some up. There we go. Hold a little bit of pressure. Top that sprue off. All right. All right, we'll see how that turns out. All right, let's see what we got. So, those are the tails. I'm going to go ahead and pour a few more, see how much, uh, see how many I can get out of the plastic that I got, and then I'll put these into the, the mold and uh, finish it up. Alright, i got to sit down while I do this because my eyes are not good enough to do it standing up, so hopefully y'all can kind of see. But with this crappie fluke mold, you take your tails and they just sit where the tail would sit in the back of the mold and uh, just load them up kind of press them down make sure that you get the back fins separated and in the right slots and if you do that should be in pretty good shape so there's four of them right there that's half then you'll put the other half on the other side come on get in the hole there we go Come on, there we go. And then once you've got all your tails in, you can close the mold up. Then I like to use one of these clamps to clamp it. I only have to use one on this. I have to use two on the tail mold because it just 
it'll fall over if you don't. I have to kind of use a second clamp to counterbalance the first clamp, but this one stands up really strong with just one clamp. So, all right, let's heat up our plastic and shoot these baits. All right, I got my second cup of Plastisol ready. I only put this one in for a minute and then stirred it and then put it in for another 30 seconds and then stirred it and then put it in for another 10 seconds and that got it up to about 365. Uh, put that other Plastisol in there for a minute and a half and when I pulled it out it was at about 414, 415 degrees. A little bit hot so didn't want to do that again so I started off just cooking it for a minute and then slowly going up and got it right where I want it. We're going to go ahead and add our black colorant. That's probably about 15 drops. Oh yeah. And that was uh, MF. <clears throat> the black color we're using is uh, MF No Bleed Black, so um, it shouldn't bleed onto the chartreuse. But go ahead and check our temperature and shoot this thing. Three. About 317, I'll pop it in the microwave for about 15 seconds. About 359, that's perfect. Let's go ahead and put our gloves on for safety. Shoot these. Go ahead and draw up our plastic. Push down till it stops, hold a little bit of pressure. see how these turn out all right let's see what we got <laughs> looks pretty much like black and chartreuse crappie flukes to me um, Robert, when you watch this video, you'll have to tell me what you think. Hopefully, uh, hopefully this is what you're looking for. But looks like black and chartreuse crappie flukes. I um, guess I can go ahead and load some more tails and shoot some more baits. All right, so there we go. That is 40 black and chartreuse crappie flukes. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the like button. If you're new to my channel, please hit the subscribe button. And if you have any ideas for colors you'd like to see me try to pour with this mold, uh, leave them in the comments. I also plan on getting more molds in the future. So if you have any ideas on any molds that you'd like to see me purchase and make baits with, uh, leave me a suggestion for those in the comments. And as always, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it.